Hey guys, it's me Tafsun from Team Big. Oh shit, here we go again, getting roasted from the community. This is the Backforce Hater interview. A team that don't deserve to be on a major, 100% idiot, trash, choker team. Major don't deserve that. I mean, if we are that big of a choker team, I don't think we would be in the major and uh, we made at least the top 10. So, uh, thank you for your comment, man. I bet versus Big, Tapsen, Faven, Sin, playing games of life. I bet on Big, Hoopsen, since, since Shui, Hooven, nothing special. Yeah, I mean, then you sh uh, should bet all the time against us because it's good to have live games and I think it's nice. Tactically monotony, even my grand grandmother know how to beat you. Yeah, I mean, then your grandmother is pretty skilled. Maybe I can meet her and she can give me some advices. Would be very lovely. This band, all you noobs, with double zero instead of O. Don't pick us two ever or never. Delayed CSGO. I mean, uh, I can ensure you that we will definitely not pick in the next time Das Two because it's out of the map pool, so uh, at least you will be happy there. Big greater than dog shit. Big Academy would have actually played better. Yeah, that's true. I mean, our Academy team is really good. Um, and yeah, I think we are also good. Maybe we can one time play against our Academy in the grand final of a big tournament and yeah, we can see who is better then. Worst team to ever exist in the scene, <laughs> Limao. Imagine losing to a bunch of nobody, <laughs> only you can trash can relate. Yeah, that's true. Trash can definitely relate because everyone is kind of trash in the scene. Feeds Batman, but the community backseat gaming is definitely on point. Big become really bad since Gob B is back to coaching. And he makes like a weirdo smile. I hope not so, but... Uh... I guess he's feeling bad for me at least with his smiley, so it's not that big of a hate. Give me my money, noobs. <laughs> Don't gamble, kids. Feel bad for a great guy, Thompson, having such a bad team. I mean, I decided to be a part of the bad team, so don't be... Don't feel bad or don't be, feel sad for me. It's my decision, I love the team, I love being in a bad team. I represent the bad team and I'm just enjoying to play also bad, just to enjoy these kind of comments. It's lovely. Please kick Tapson and Gobby. Literally man, children blatantly parasiting the big organization, their whole team hates them. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's so crazy, man, how people can write this. It's literally the opposite, so I don't know what to uh, say here, but it's very funny. I like it. What are you doing on Dust2? you are. I mean, Das 2 is out now anyway, so you don't need to watch us play Das 2 anymore. You can flame us now on Anubis and yeah, you can check our new smokes there. A team that don't deserve to be in a major 100% idiot trash choker team, major don't deserve that. It's true, man. It's true. Choker team. It's kind of like G2. <laughs> Save Tapsen. Put him at G2, kick Nicola, the lineup will be Tapsen IGL, Santaris Entry, Voxic Orb, We Must Support and Hunter is the Lurker. I mean, this is the most random lineup I've ever heard. It's a good comment, I guess. Your team in CSGO, so bad. You lose Huxi, ah ha ha Trash team, disband please. And then a screenshot where we lose, okay, where Huxi just kills two guys from us to win a round for the smoke. I don't know what's so... Or um, to be ashamed of to get killed by Hooksy, I don't know, but um, we will not disband. Nice try. I hope you can still watch us play and lose your money. How 60 years old Taps is still so good? Drugs? Yeah, I feel so too, man. Drugs, emotions, feelings, everything is kind of good, man. But the community is lovely. I love the hate speeches, the love speeches. It's giving me, that's the drugs I need, you know? It's the support I get, it's the drive I get. It's a lovely motivation. Big will probably be dumb enough to pick Das2 again because they will still believe they are one of the best Das teams. If they don't pick Das2, they win. Else it's 204k23. In the end, we won Das2. It was the deciding match. Uh, and I think we didn't even pick it in the first, in the first round. So he was kind of right. We won the game, uh, but we won it in the end of the, on Das2. 
Nice round, son of the and screenshot. I don't know what he sent there. And this kick Faven, please. He dead by five HP. Monesi trash. <laughs> yeah, I mean, probably Monesi killed me even with an orb. I don't know about this, but um, yeah, if I get killed by a guy who's low HP, I should go inactive and not play CSGO anymore because this shouldn't happen to a player who has over 10,000 hours. And yeah, you are right, so I will just quit CSGO. We have Sersen, who do you have? We have the best DQ Germans, Kito, who do you have? We have the IGL, G2 Wanted, Tapson, who do you have? We raised two kids from the academy team, Crimbo and Sim, who destroyed T1 players, who do you have? We have 1.6 and overall construct legend, Gopi, who was a legend before, Safir was even born. Who do you have? We have the win. Feels bad, man. I feel that, yeah, 100%. But we still have the best players this guy mentions. But actually, on paper, it sounds really good. But obviously, if they have the win, then what can we do? We have the loss. Best in Germany, my ass. <laughs> yeah, y'all. Blow, horse, dick, you realize people bet actually money on you fat You all play this game every day and perform like that. You all suck dick. Oh my god, I beat out of every member on your team. You all got special spot in hell after this performance. Stop playing the game, you geek ass. Boy, what the fuck, man. Woo! Okay, this is uh, something incredible, I must say. Obviously, we know that people are betting on our games, but uh, if you get so much attached to to the bet you made that you are dependent that the, the team or the player or whoever is it needs to win to make yourself feel better, feel good. Obviously, if you if you win, then you feel good. But if you are dependent on that, you sh you probably shouldn't do that, man. No joke. Like it's uh, uh, obviously we also get these messages privately. You know, like uh, it's um, it's not even funny anymore because people lives depending on the bets and they get also really mad sad and it's also um, attached to the different persons you are with for example family and stuff they get also negative by the by the mood you are getting when someone's losing the game so i recommend you to really stop doing it because it's really actually it can be harsh to yourself it can be also painful for yourself man get something out of your life put the money somewhere into your hobby maybe grow flowers or whatever you want to do, but you really stop doing it and you do me a favor, you do every player a favor. Obviously, I kind of not enjoy, but um, like I feel the way how you write the message, like I, how you sit in front of the computer and you And then obviously like, oh man, I lost the money. And then at some point I realized like, you are actually like not a, like you're a clown to me because you're a random guy you just try to insult me insult everyone here in this building who's giving the life for this moment the project and you don't know anything but obviously if in the end of the day it's just a message from a random guy but take care what you write in the internet it's a dangerous spot but in the, at the same time it's a very beautiful thing what the internet uh, made Made, uh, made it possible that we all can enjoy something beautiful. It's esports, it's Counter Strike, and it's all relation relationship because we all kind of feel the same. Someone feels the same in the professional way. Someone feels the fa uh, feels the way as a fan. We are all kind of in the same place. So let's make it something beautiful. All right, guys. Thank you for watching the Backforce Hater interview. Right now, you can write something nice below. It would be nice to read something good instead of all the hate but um, yeah as you can see it's just kids writing bullshit and yeah thank you guys and see you next time